Look away this week, kind of humid and rainy. All right, time for the daily list now this morning. I love this one. I saw it online. I was so <laughs> excited. You probably don't think you're spreading germs as you just go about your day, but chances are you do at least one of the things on this list this morning. Oh, on wow. the daily list, three germy habits to stop right now. And they're not obvious ones, okay. like using your phone in the bathroom. I'm not even going to do that one. That one is so obvious. Okay. All right. Number one, opening things with your teeth. Mm. You know, sometimes you can't yeah. get a package open. Yeah, it may seem more convenient and occasionally more effective to get it started using your choppers. However, choppers. not only can this be potentially damaging to your teeth, but it can also spread germs. In yeah. addition to the germs from your own mouth now being transferred to the package, you're also making contact with any germs that were already on the package when you put it in your mouth. Sick. Ugh. So invest in it. You don't know who touched that before you picked it up. Oh. So invest in a good pair of scissors and keep them handy already. All right, number two, blowing out birthday candles. Oh, look at Elisa's face. Unless your <laughs> birthday wish, mother of two, is to have germs all over your cake, you might want to reconsider this common tradition. When you blow out the candles, or a kid does, you're releasing bacteria that's inside your mouth. Oh, yes, you can go. Yes, you can see it happen when oh, yeah. the kids blow them. Spit all over the surface of the cake. All over it. No, thanks. I'll just have ice cream. While there's a slim chance of anybody getting sick from those germs, it's still a little icky, especially since a study showed that blowing out candles causes the amount of bacteria on the surface of a cake to increase by 1,400 percent. Oh, boom. Gross. I'm not inviting her. I'll just anyway. have, you know, <laughs> let's just have individual cupcakes and a special one for the birthday child, and the rest of us can just That's exactly eat. Right. All right, and number three, I just did this yesterday, eating at your desk. That's we do, right? We don't, we don't have time to go time. anywhere. Well, now you have an excuse to get up and walk around and actually try to take a break during your lunch break. Not to gross you out, but your computer keyboard is most likely home to some serious gross germs, unless you clean it regularly, which no one does. So if you eat gross. your food on the same surface as your keyboard, you run the risk of ingesting those germs, which are definitely not on your menu. Mm -hmm. Blech, all that stuff for no, more. Thanks. And probably Marianne. at least three more that I wish I had time to tell enjoying you about. Hope you're enjoying your breakfast. Yeah. Go to <laughs> <laughs> Click show info there at the top of the page. Enjoy and your morning. Days, <laughs> dates of the person just ripped open that granola with their teeth. Ew. And happy birthday. Yeah. Happy, happy birthday. birthday to you. Happy birthday. Yeah. <laughs> thanks, yeah. Chloe. Happy birthday. I'll just have ice cream, thanks. Right, right. I'm okay. good. Okay. Great. You have to read the rest of the list. It's just, you're, it's just, it's shocking. It's shocking. Shocking. <laughs> shocking. Okay. Some wild birds are getting the reputation for being.